Oh, hi. So, here is my little circuit. I wanted to try and do it in a pseudo-dead bug. Not really dead bug, more just kind of bare uh, style. I didn't feel like doing PCB, and I kind of like the way these hacky things look all, like, thrown together. Um, so the only wires I use right now are currently... I'm being I'm using to uh, close uh, the, the closure. The, the, that this is going to be on the the fridge eventually. That'll test whether the fridge door or the freezer are open. Um, same logic as before. Got a pull up resistor. Got a resistor for the LED. Got the transistor to drive the speaker. Yada yada yada. Uh, cool. So now I'm going to position this down into the pillow so that we don't wake up Haley. And I'm going to plug it in. And let's keep the light on here. Alright, plugged in. There's the LED. It's 30 seconds. So as long as that LED is lit, it's going to uh, be counting down. Hopefully this isn't too loud. Maybe I'll try and keep my... No, I can't see anything. I'll just be ready with the switch. Thirty seconds is a long time. And there it is. And if I let go, time starts again. So that's it. We'll probably build a little Lego enclosure around this thing. Um, mm, yeah, that's it. And like I said, the nice thing about these uh, processors are they run off uh, 5 volts, which is like, you know, a normal cell phone charger. So I've got this little nice USB guy. And everybody's happy. Hooray!